back to my channel today I'm gonna show you how to do this look I'm wearing um, it's a very nice smoky uh, browny um, look I'm going out tonight eating a pizza in Naples so I wanted to do something beautiful but uh, not too over dramatic with crazy colors so that's the result it's very luminous as you can see on the skin on the eyes lots of highlighting um, I hope you like it and I'll leave you to the video bye I start by using some strobe liquid cream by MAC which is an iridescent very pearlescent cream so it's gonna give us this glowy look on the skin as a foundation I'm using the Prolong Wear My MAC in number NC25. It's a very long wearing, long lasting foundation, up to 18 hours and it dries matte. And because I'm going out I wanted something really really long lasting. I'm applying it with a dual fiber brush by MAC in number 130. As a concealer, I'm using the Studio Finish Concealer by MAC in NW25, just into the inner corners. Now I'm using this Prep and Prime highlighting pen in two different colors. This is Bright Forecast, just to get rid of any discoloration underneath my eyes and I'm patting and blending the color with my fingers. Now, just in the bags area, I'm putting the lighter color, which is Light Boost, to make my bags recede. Now moving to the eyebrows, I'm just combing them and applying some fluid line deep down by MAC. So that's how I'm painting my brows. If you want to see um, how to do your brows in three different ways, you can watch my video on the brows as well. Uh, and moving to the primer, I'm using my Soft Ochre Paint Pot on the whole eyelid and pick up until the brows. On the eyes as a shadow I'm using Patina by MAC which is a very luminous shadow I'm applying it onto the eyelid. Now starting with the crease I'm using Charcoal Brown which is a medium cool toned brown in the uh, outside part and then just blending it towards my crease really softly. Now I take this other uh, color which is Coral always by MAC, is a matte eyeshadow. I'm applying it from the end of the eyes and then blending it towards the crease. We now take bronze eyeshadow, always by MAC, you can use any bronze eyeshadow just to warm the crease a little bit. And now take a cool tones, um, darker brown than the one we used before. This one is Espresso by MAC, I was applying it just in the end of the eyes elongating it towards the end and blending it to the crease. Now we're gonna perfect the brows using some prolonged wear concealer in number MT30 and just blending it with a soft brush. And for pigments I'm using some um, naked pigments by MAC. Sorry, not naked, this is tan pigments in the middle of the eyelid and in a corner. I'm taking again deep down eyeliner which I use on my brows and I'm gonna draw a line across my eyes as an eyeliner with a very small flick in the end. I'm now curling my lashes and applying some MAC Pearl Glide Lord It Up pencil which is a really nice iridescent very luminous pencil so I'm applying it underneath my eyes not going all the way around and in the inner waterline I'm applying a battery uh, pencil, this is a chromographic pencil by MAC and I'm blending the pencil underneath with some uh, bronzy eyeshadow. It's time for mascara and some falsies, I'm using Duvelure Lashes Doll Me Up which I cut a little bit to fit my eye shape. To set the base, I'm using Self Studio Fix powder in NC25 all over, which is a really nice velvety powder, which gives us most, more coverage. And moving to contouring, I'm taking from my Slick palette the matte shade, start building the cheeks, and then always um, I'm doing the nose as well to make it slimmer. 
and from the same palette I'm taking the shimmery shade and just giving some warmth to the skin applying it to the top of the cheeks as a blusher I'm using this amazing blush from MAC it's a mineralized blush warm soul which is also really good on its own because it gives this really luminous look to the skin and soft and gentle has highlighting of course in the middle of the nose on the cupid's bow and down the top of my cheeks on the lips i'm prepping it with some prep and prime lips by mac and applying some 047 cappuccino pencil by rimmel london after doing the shape on my lips i'm gonna apply some lipstick of course and I'm using Taupe by MAC and that's the finished look If you liked the video please give me thumbs up share it on your social media so i can reach other people as well um, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel underneath below if you are not thank you for watching i'll see you to the next video bye